Hey there, Scorpios, and welcome back for another Scorpio love reading. Uh, Scorpio, I hope this video finds you guys doing absolutely amazing, Scorpios. I hope you are vibing high, Scorpio. I hope you are setting your intentions. I hope you are fighting for your rights, Scorpio. Uh, Scorpio, you know what? I keep on hearing, this is a man's world. But it's not, this is a man's world. I keep hearing this is a woman's world. And this ain't no shade to the masculine, Scorpio. Don't come for me or any other masculine that may be coming across this channel. But I'm here to remind you, Scorpio, it's about you. For the feminines, and this is not no shade. This ain't no sexist thing. This ain't nothing like this. not trying to cause no division. But I was just hip to some intellectual game, Scorpio. Don't you know that the women run this? The feminines run it? You know, I feel like it's time to adopt that you are that energy, Scorpio. It seems like the problems come in, Scorpio, when we start to uh, give the love to the men and make them feel like, look, the masculines more than what they more than what they are. Uh, since that we have a lot of masculines who are incarcerated, <laughs> I'm going somewhere. Bear with me. <laughs> Some of these masculines, they're already in relationships and some of these masculines are in same-sex relationships and that's okay too. Then it seems like the, the pickings are slim. But that's not the case, Scorpio. It's still, whatever you want, you still can get it. It's just putting yourself in the position to get it. You don't chase nothing. It comes to you, Scorpio, but you got to be in that energy here, Scorpio. Now, I know some people going to be scratching their head on that, Scorpio, but I'm telling you, you adopt that energy, You'll feel a lot better here, Scorpio. And I know you won't love Scorpio, but <laughs> seems like seems like whatever you want, with the exception of materialistic things for love, Scorpio, you can't go find it. You can't pursue love. You gotta let it come to you. Now, the, the materialistic things here, it seems like the uh the emotional fulfillment, you have to let it come to you. But as far as your career and stuff like that, you have to go for that. Ain't that something? If you want love, Scorpio, don't chase it. It'll come. It, it'll come. That, that, that's just for real, Scorpio. <laughs> now, other than that, Scorpio, thank you guys so much, Scorpio, for tuning into this channel here. I appreciate you guys so much. Thank you for my my members here. While I'm checking into your, your energy here, Scorpio, you have... Oof. The Seven of Swords here. So I don't know what that's about here, Scorpio. You got an emperor here. Somebody here who is not being honest. Someone who, here who's not showing their hands to you here, Scorpio. Let's see. I'm going to do this reading a little bit different. I'm going to flow. I got, them all, I got them all wrong here. Page of Pentacles. Knight of Cups here. Strength. So it could very well be here, Scorpio. Ooh, you got the devil. The star. So some of you guys may feel a push and pull here. Someone is obsessing over you, Scorpio. Someone got, I feel like someone is trying to tame this beast that they have inside of them, Scorpio, uh, because they want to come in here and offer you their cup of love here. Someone is trying to uh, keep the flame down. They're, they're trying so hard not to come, but you hear that? <laughs> they, they try not to come, but you are this person's wish fulfilled. It could be an Aquarius, could be a Capricorn, could be a Leo. Could be a, another Scorpio Cancer Pisces here. But someone's going to reach out here to you, Scorpio. For somebody, somebody here who is really, really wanting you, really, really wanting you very, very badly, has been really fighting the urge to come back around you, Scorpio. Let's see. What else for Scorpio? Like I said, could be a, 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 um, a Leo, a, a Capricorn, an Aquarius here. Let's see. What else for Scorpio? Nine of Cups, see, I tell you. See, they say you everything to them, Scorpio. That, that's why they can't seem to get you off of their mind here. So I keep that. Now that now they're going to Seven of Swords. See, somebody here, I feel like someone was hiding their feelings for you, Scorpio. But in order for them to, to um, quench this, this, this real big thirst that they have, that they're going to have to be honest about something. They're going to have to be honest about how they feel because they, I feel like they're trying to come in here with the Knight of Cups here. Like I say, you are this person's wish fulfilled. I feel like this person dreams about you. And I feel like if somebody was trying to hide how they feel about you, Scorpio, they trying to come. See, this person's been secretly watching you. 
Whoever this is could be a Libra, Gemini, or an Aquarius. And see, they want to rush you in so freaking bad here, Scorpio. And But they keep on watching you here to either see how you're doing, see if somebody else. You see this person picking behind a tree? Is they picking behind a tree? Look, they, they trying to get, you see how they move? This person keep watching you. This is what it is, Scorpio. Somebody is watching you here, Scorpio. Somebody may feel like you have other options too, Scorpio. Let me see. I'm going to pull you full spread, but let me do these little miniatures right here. Let me see. All right, spirit. What else for Scorpio? What does Scorpio need to know? Oh, Scorpio, don't forget to join my membership. Uh, go to my homepage, hit the join button, and you will be a part of the highly favored crew. Eight of wheels here. See? Somebody's trying to work because you can see. There it is again. Somebody's losing themselves in their work. Now, it could be you. Maybe you're trying to hold yourself back from the urge. <laughs> Maybe you're trying to tame that Scorpio bees here. See there? And when you go to sleep, it don't help. See? Because somebody sees somebody as this empress here. See? There it go again here. See? Six of wands. They watching you. They watching this empress here. See there? This person's paying a lot of attention to you. And this person may want your attention here. This person may be, see, this person may really be watching you here. You see this person looking and you got this person here wanting your attention. It's the empress here. It's somebody here who you don't know here who is doing this too. Was it the four cups? Somebody here who you may have turned down in the past here. Let me see. Oh, let me get these cards. Got the empress. You got that six of wands and you got that page of so seven of swords. Seven of swords because... I feel like it's somebody, because I see that high priest, somebody who you haven't heard from, someone who is not talking, but behind the scenes, they either going behind your back, asking folks about you, or this person is watching your, your post. Uh, this person, if you got a platform, they pad, this person is, is trying to figure out things. This person going around people, you got mutual friends. See, there you go again, Knight of Cups. Because they want to come in here and offer you their cup of love. They want, they looking for you, Scorpio. They, they looking for you, Scorpio. This person's looking for you. Whoever this person is, they're looking for you, Scorpio. And please believe you ain't heard from somebody. They don't mean nothing because whoever this person is, their silence is probably tricking you because you think that this person ain't into you. But the whole time, this person talking about you behind your back or going to your mama them or going to your job or going to your mutual friend or going somewhere. Now your overall energy here is the Ace of Cups. Now I've already I've already shuffled and sage. You also have the three of three of swords here. See, this is reminding me of like someone here who, like I said, somebody here who's not telling you what, what's, what's going on. Or if it's someone you walked away from, this is someone here who is not letting you know uh, the real effects that it's having on them ever since you left. Because they want to start over. They want a new beginning, god dang, Scorpio. Now, you know they always want to come back, Scorpio. Don't, don't do that now. All right, Spirit. What else for Scorpio here? What, what, who is coming towards Scorpio in love? Spirit, show me Scorpio. The fool. Could be an Aries. For some of y'all, somebody here who finna take a leap of faith and approach you. Especially if you stood your ground and if you walked away, you're not saying anything. You know what I'm saying? You ain't went back. You know how you go back, you test the waters here? But that's cool, Scorpio. Even if you send them a little message and you say, hey, I'm just checking to see how you was doing. As long as you ain't been just really, just really chasing this person, it's messing with their head. And I feel like it's in your advantage here, Scorpio. Let's see here. What is this? The world card. There's a distance between you two. The high priestess. See, I feel like there's no communication. And I feel like somebody is stressing. I see this Queen of Pentacles. Maybe this is you and this Queen of Pentacles. Maybe look, look. Queen of Pentacles, Ace of Pentacles, King of Swords. There go justice. Mm. Okay. So you got justice showing up again, Scorpio. There go the Knight of Swords again, and justice. Some of y'all dealing with the air sign. I know some of y'all dealing with the air sign, but like I said, somebody probably thought that you were going to reach back out or maybe you've been gone too long, Scorpio. This is kind of like the other reading. You got you got the Ace of Pentacles. Let me see, make sure you can see. You got the Ace of Pentacles and the Ace of Cups here. Someone is in their feelings here. Now, it could be you, but I don't feel like it's you. 
I feel like something that you're not saying here and it's triggering someone. Look at look at what's the in the the middle of you guys. The, this difference, this this gap. The world is the difference. You could, guys are at a distance here. There's no communication brings stress to someone. You not talking is 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 making this 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 distance wider here. And it's affecting them. I feel like it's affecting them because I feel like you and the Queen of Pentacles, Queen or King, it doesn't matter. You're focused on other things, but look, you got the King of Swords. Now you see the difference. King of Swords and the Queen of Pentacles. So this is someone here who is usually detached uh, emotionally, but they are logical. You know, they do analyze. They do make head, head over hard decisions here. Um, it's almost like this person wants to take a leap of faith here because they're tired of stressing. And uh, they've really thought about it in this King of Swords energy. A new opportunity of love is coming your way. Uh, a new a new cycle here that's going to uh, bring you guys closer together here. Uh, and perhaps either it's going to make you more stable in a relationship, Scorpio. Or for some of you guys, you got a new opportunity. You guys could be launching your own career or doing your own thing. Uh, and then out of the clear blue, here come love. You could be Mr. or Mrs. Business, Scorpio, and you just on your grind and only focus on you. And then out of nowhere, love drops in your life. Someone is hurt. Three of swords here. And I feel like it's because there's no communication. And I feel like even though there's hurt because no communication for whatever reason, there's still a new opportunity here. Ooh, Scorpio. Now look at you. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's see what's going on here. Now you got Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. You got Aries. You got Aries in the high. Okay. You got Aries, Taurus. Leo, Scorpio, and um, Aquarius. And you got Pisces here. So those are your majors. You got the King of Swords. You got the cups. How many cups you got? You got the Ace of Cups. That's the only cup in here. <laughs> That's the only cup in here, Scorpio. But you got the Nine of Swords, the Three of Swords, and this King of Swords. So this is a very, very peculiar energy. It's like, it's almost like you're going on with your life and you don't care and it's it's not fair to somebody. Somebody feels like it may not be fair here. Someone may feel like it's not fair because they may be looking like, damn, I'm stressed out because there's a, there's a distance between the two of us. It's not fair. You're not talking. Some of you guys not talking here. And like I said, it could be a Libra with this justice card here. Make some room. The justice card right here. You can see it right there. All right, let's clarify these Scorpios. Now, Scorpio, I forgot to tell you, this is a general. It's not going to resonate for everyone. Please only take the part that fits. Be that high priestess. You know more about your situation than I do, okay? So this relationship is suspended in the air. It's just hanging in the balance. It's not going nowhere here. I feel like someone was in denial about something. And you may, you may be saying to yourself, I see now. I know what's going on. Some of you guys may feel like you cannot have this. So you're walking away. Wow, Scorpio. Wow. It's the hangman overall energy. Could be a Pisces here. All right, Spirit. Why is this Ace of Cups? No. Let's start with this King of Swords. Why is this King of Swords here for Scorpio? Clarify this King of Swords. King of Swords is clarified by the tower. You could be dealing with the Aries or you're another Scorpio here. So this is something that came down, a shocking event that happened with this King of Swords. Now, this is your reading. Now, either this you affected this person here, obviously, because this is your energy showing up for this person here. Whew, so something came down here and, and, and you guys have not fixed it since with this hangman. All right, Spirit, clarify this King of Swords. What is this King of Swords? Who is this King of Swords for? Scorpio Spirit. Clarify the King of Swords. King of Swords. <laughs> Knight of Wands. Leo, Sagittarius, and Aries energy. That's that flighty energy here. Some may, maybe this was a, a, a shocking moment for you. Something came down. Maybe you're finding out that somebody didn't want to settle down. Maybe you found out this person was a player. Let's see. One more card for this King of Swords here. King of Swords. Three of Wands. 
So this person here is probably turned there. Either you turned your back on this person. Maybe this person was out here seeing if something else was out here, especially this Knight of Wands. So maybe this is a realization to you, Scorpio, that you find out that this person who was detached uh, really, really wasn't emotionally or or anything invested. Uh, they were just only in here for the for the moment. You know, they were waiting for things, and you probably feel like this unfair with the justice in reverse. It showed up again. You probably feeling like, you know, this person here, they didn't want nothing. They were too busy looking to see if something better was out here. And this could have been this. Now, I feel like, or, or maybe this person is waiting, but I feel like this person was waiting for something better. Let me get another card. Shit. King of Swords for Scorpio. Look, snap. <laughs> King of Swords. <laughs> this person is very, very stubborn, Scorpio, and cold. I feel like it's this person, Scorpio, they set in their ways here and you got the picture. Whatever the memo was, Scorpio, I feel like you got it, okay? Now, why is this three of swords here? This is why you probably ain't stuck in their asses now. Spirit, clarify this three of swords for Scorpio. Why is this here? Three of swords. <laughs> Two of pentacles here. Somebody couldn't make up their mind. I feel like it's this person... Can't make up their mind about what to do. Wow, somebody felt stuck. Somebody may have felt stuck or trapped. You may have, somebody may have felt stuck in the situation here. So instead of since they didn't know what to do, they just chose to hold back. Then Scorpio, oh my goodness, Oof. But I don't see this is this is a different type of energy here. Oh, let's see. Uh, the three of swords spirit. Why is the three of swords here for Scorpio on this person? See, this person's trying to decide whether or not. I feel like this person, this is this, this is what I initially got here. This person here, this is why this person's trying to figure out whether or not to pursue you again, Scorpio. It's because shit, you know, I don't blame it. They I feel like they know that they did not do right. See there, Scorpio? This this dry ass, cold ass king of swords, energy, Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius. So you got the king of swords, the tower. I feel like this was a realization to you. Maybe it's a realization to the King of Swords here. Maybe they're realizing that they were really cold and detached. Because after all, you have the justice. You on Underneath the bottom, you got the justice in the reverse. This is why this person, maybe this person was too impulsive to get what they want. But they were slow as hell. Look, maybe they were too impulsive, uh, unattached to get what they want. But when it came to love, maybe they 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 were they were voided of it. See, but with the whole time, maybe this is being illuminated to this person. Maybe they were manipulative. Ooh, Scorpio. See, I feel like this is them. They realized they didn't do right. Maybe this person was rushing in on you. Maybe this person was too aggressive to get what they want. But like I said, you got this here. So something is going to... They are aware that it wasn't fair. This is why it's in the upright because you're going to get it. See, it could very well be that this King of Swords is realizing that they ass was very, very cold and detached. This could be a, a realization to them. Uh, why? Because they probably were only out just for a little fun. The Knight of Wands, they wouldn't plant no roots. That's why the Ace of Pentacles is there. Hmm. This is somebody here who wasn't built. They just wanted a good time here. This person really wasn't settling down because they felt like, I guess they felt like uh, something better was out there. Once again, the King of Swords. This was somebody here who was recognizing themselves here, Scorpio, because you got the King of Swords twice. Now, as the King of Swords, they're very, very analytical. This person had to step outside themselves and look at things on a, a mental way. Their emotions ain't involved when they're seeing this, so they're seeing the truth. They were the freaking problem. They were too freaking cold and too too pushy. They, they were just self, but they were only out for what they wanted here. What I'm seeing here, and I feel like maybe they're 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 uh, it's a realization to them. It's what I feel like here, because you got the full card here. You got the full card right here, and the only problem is the two of pentacles is because I feel like they're the reason why it's it's a juggle, it's a it's a, um, a decision going back and forth is because. Shit, if you did somebody like this, I wouldn't be wanting to go back to them either. If you treating them like this, cold, detached, but only coming in here to get what you want, but you ain't going to settle down because you feel like it's better, but yet still you coming in. So hell yeah, they, they got apprehensions. This person is worried and stressed because this is how they left the situation. So now they want to come back because I feel like you're not invested in them now. 
They could have even broke your heart too, but I feel like they're receiving the heartbreak now. You're not showing up in cup energy, you're showing up in pinnacle energy. So you're not emotionally, avo you, you, I feel like you're avoiding, you, you, you're not into that now. You've moved away and I feel like you see things for what they are with this person. But this person's looking at themselves here. They can't, they don't have a choice but to look at themselves because they want to come back with this full card here. Maybe this person said that they were very, very reckless here with you. Maybe they were reckless here, but I feel like this person is scared. They want you, but they know how they left it. Why is the three of swords here? Three of swords. See? So then maybe this person is holding on to you. Or maybe they're holding back. Because see, I feel like this, like I said, I feel like this is, see, this, it, like I always tell you, when this king of swords show up, it be like that. It's like their, their mental thing, whatever they dealing with, because you got the fool card, then you got the four of pentacles. So either you're going to go for it or you're going to hold back. This is why the two of pentacles here, this person keep going back and forth. Whoever this person is, they, they have ADHD or something because they, look, this is what they're going back and forth. Should they hold back and just, just let it stay like it is or should they go on and throw it, take a leap of faith and go on and go for it? This person's in their head. They don't know. And I feel like either this is because this is what how they feel. I feel like this person feel like, well, she, the, the damage is already done now. Should I, should I come in? Should I do it? Oof. Ooh, Scorpio. Like I say, this King of Swords is complicated. Oh, this King of Swords, whoever this air, air sign is, is complicated. It's hard to deal with this person. I can tell. Why is this nine of swords here, spirit? Clarify this nine of swords. Nine of swords because they need to heal. And this person is worried that they're not going to get their wish fulfilled. You remember we saw the nine of cups and the star card in their pre-shuffle here. That's what it is. This person, they're stressing, they're worried because they're not, see, because they know that they, they didn't do it right. There you go. They know they owe you something here, Scorpius. I feel like it's a Libra. Know that they did not do you right. They did not handle things right. And then instead of them coming around here, building with you, they came around here with the wand in their hand all the goddamn time. Rushing in upon you, knowing that they ain't had nothing to offer or that they wasn't going to offer because they was too busy waiting on something else. Now, maybe they were waiting on another relationship. I feel like here they cold ass energy. And I feel like they're looking at themselves now. So now you have this nine of swords. See, this person to know that they didn't do you right because maybe they moved too fast about what they wanted. I feel like somebody was too busy trying to rush in and get what they want and they didn't care about you emotionally. They didn't show emotion. They were just only about them and they know that they did wrong. And that's why they stressing because they ass want you back. See, there's Scorpio, this person here, they don't know how to love. I feel like this is their approach on everything. They don't come sweet and loving and, and, and sweeping you off your feet type of shit. That ain't what they used to doing, but that's what Scorpio is used to getting. But not this person. They just, just heartless and just right to the point and right on out. So this person here is aware of this with this justice card here. They, they did you unfairly. Please believe, Scorpio. They're dealing with your ancestors are, are dealing with this person. They're not getting any sleep. They're not. And you know why they're not getting no sleep, Scorpio? Because some of y'all, y'all ancestors don't play about y'all. And because y'all were really hurt by this person. Because this person should have been swooing you off of your feet and offering you their cup of love. But instead, they were just rushing in for a good time here. When the whole time you were sent to this person here. And for some of y'all, did you manifested this person. But once again, they just wanted intimacy. See? They thought you was beautiful and attractive, but they weren't, they weren't building those, Scorpio, for somebody. Whew. What's up with this Queen of Pentacles? I feel like this is your energy, Scorpio. Clarify this Queen of Pentacles for Scorpio. Why is this here? Queen of Pentacles. <laughs> Seven of Wands here, see? Y'all pissed off at this person. Y'all, y'all, y'all know y'all feel like this person ain't nothing to y'all, Scorpio. See, this is why I started out the reading saying it's the feminines that run it. It's just that we give these masculines so much. It's so many feminine. And y'all, this ain't no shade. I'm, please hear me. It's, it's not like this. See? The devil, you blocking that shit. 
And some of y'all said, F you, I can get it on my own because the universe going to guide me. See, go on, get it, Scorpio. Get that shit, Scorpio. <laughs> oh, see that, Scorpio? See that, Scorpio? You see that? See that? This is why they're stressing out now because they watch you and they don't see nothing in your energy that make them feel like you want their ass back. And they can, they done effed up, Scorpio. Somebody know they done effed up, Scorpio. They didn't, they didn't did it to the wrong one. They didn't did it to the wrong one here. Should you sit around here on your ground as the queen of Pentacles? You, you are a, indeed marriage material. You are a good asset to anybody here. But look what you're doing. You're blocking their ass because you said, no, I don't, I don't need your toxic uh, attachments. I just do me. See, Scorpio? And for some of y'all, you blocking this person because they were selfish. They were selfish and self-centered. They only cared about they self here, Scorpio. But I'm going to look at it like you're single here. You're the queen of Pentacles. I feel like some of y'all are single. You got rid of this, this devil energy from this person here, Scorpio. Mm -mm. Why is this world card here for Scorpio spirit? Clarify the world. See that, Scorpio? That's why you can't burn your bridge. See, I, it seems like this is a learned pattern. This person has been living this way for so long, rushing in. Whatever they see they want, they rushing after it. They rush after it with no heart, no no, no emotions whatsoever. You know, that that's so sad when they... I feel like this person don't know how to love, Scorpio. This person don't know how to love. And they are aware that they did not treat you right. Ooh, Scorpio. That's why they ass can't sleep at night. The world for Scorpio. There's a completion here. See, that, that you, you finally closed the cycle with this devil energy with this person. This person had you, Scorpio. You know? Because you wanted love and there's nothing wrong with that. And you were only given to this relationship because you were trying to build and nourish this relationship, but they were taking advantage because they were, this was a robot. Like I keep saying, every time I see this King of Swords energy, somebody was a robot here, Scorpio. I feel like they didn't know how to love. And it keep on reminding me of, I, I did one of those readings. It could have been on the other channel. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to my other channel, Truth Revealer, uh, at Truth Revealer 3363. It does collective divine masculines and feminines, uh, all the other zodiac signs here. But I remember seeing that Ten of Pentacles, Queen of Cups, and the Empress in reverse. And I instantly knew that that was generational. That, that, that was on the masculine side. So I know that these masculines are dealing with emotionless feminines that they were dealing with. And please believe these feminines get that way because of those masculines that they deal with. So some of these mothers, they still ain't healed from the, the, the them soul ties they got with the child's father or childhood issues. So they don't love, you know, you know, it's hard for boys. I talked to so many men, they got issues with their mother. Anytime you talk to a person and it, it should really be a red flag to you. If you talk to a person and they got issues with their mother to the point where they really act like they hate their mother. That person ain't good for you. Now I can understand because I done met a couple of men, but they would end up good, being good dudes too. But at the same time, when they act like they hate their mama, I don't know. I, I talked to some that like they hate their mother and something you don't know unless you're in that position here. But that's the thing. And then these mothers don't love these kids, right? Or they don't have a father figure around. Then when they grow up, that's what we deal with. We deal with these men. And then the same thing, they deal with us the same way, Scorpio. So it's almost like, that's why you had the Knight of Cups in the reverse, but you got the Knight of Swords in, in the upright. This person's approach was all off. They got the problem. Who's with that devil card? Mm. All right, spirit, the world for Scorpio and this person. What's going on here, spirit? What's going on, the world? Sad, really sad, the world. <laughs> Page of Wands. So this is someone here who is uh, craving adventure. Someone here who is just not taking life. You may be taking things. See, Scorpio, look at you. Look at you. Look at you, Scorpio. See there? The Empress here. You got somebody coming. Some, somebody coming, though. See that? Some of y'all was dealing with this King of Swords energy. 
and they turned you cold, really cold to them, Scorpio. But look here, though. Spirit is telling you, though. Some of you guys are not looking for no relationship. You're just taking things slow. You're just having a good time. Some of you guys are going to start traveling more. I feel like you're going to have new invite outs here. But I feel like you're going to take your time in this Knight of Pentacles here. And you're just going to continue to grow and, and just love yourself and just live a happy, free life. Because you're in this Queen of Pentacles. Like, I feel like something is really growing for you. I feel like if you take your time here and just focus on you, you're going to have good things coming your way. But Spirit is also cautioning you don't have to rush for nothing. You are already the Empress here. Just take your time enjoying life. Allow yourself to be a kid again. Don't let these relationships destroy your energy or your youthfulness because it's brighter days ahead. And I feel like what this is about to attract is some type of commitment here with this four of wands. See, you finna get out that queen of swords energy because I feel like you was mirroring this king of swords here and you're going to be very, very successful at it. You finna finally get a commitment where you're going to be successful at, but sometimes you stay in relationships where, where they're so... They're cold to, to you turn cold. You know how it is. They, they treat you that way. It's hard to love a king of swords if they're acting cold and detached. So some of y'all mirroring this person here. Y'all, this is why spirits say have fun. Uh, allow your, your, your inner child to, to come alive. Don't let this relationship make you cold and detached like them. No, you the empress. You got full of life, full of love, full of abundance. You got so much new opportunities surrounding you. You, you have rebirth in your spiritual belly here. This don't stop nothing. It just stopped they asses because somebody still want it. Ooh, Scorpio, see, I feel my hip coming in here, <laughs> Scorpio, see. This is why their ass is stressing, Scorpio. They are aware. This person is aware that they held back, that they were indecisive, they couldn't make up their mind because they have issues and they put their issues off on Scorpio. So now you have the high priestess here. Why is this high priestess here for Scorpio? The high priestess is, ooh, snap, the Ten of Pentacles. Now what's this here? Is this someone hiding this Ten of Pentacles here? Could be someone secretly hiding a whole family here. Oh, Scorpio, I hope not. Or this could be you. Oh, Scorpio, you could be behind the scenes working on some shit, Scorpio, because you, after all, you're the queen of Pentacle. Oh, Scorpio. Oh, wow. For some of y'all, Scorpio, this person was in a relationship. The reason why they were doing you the way they were doing you, Scorpio, because they were in a relationship. But guess what? This person is walking away from it. Maybe you walked away from this because you felt like this person was in another relationship here, Scorpio. Maybe your, your intuition was telling you that this person was already in a relationship and this is why you walked away from them. Ooh, but so somebody, and you may have claimed defeat with this five of swords. Or you may have felt defeated here because I feel like this person did something wrong. I feel like for some of y'all, this person already had a whole family, but they only came over here for intimacy. And spirit is getting them. They were wrong, Scorpio. And I feel like they're going to have to make it up to you because it's on them. Answers are not going to let this person rest. Ooh, let me pull some more cards. Let me see. But I think that that's what it is. I'm going to put another card. All right, Spirit. Why is this high priestess and this ten of pentacles here for Scorpio? Clarify. <laughs> y'all, when I tell y'all Spirit be talking, Spirit say because it is what I said it is. That go to eight of cups. See? You may have walked away from this person because you felt like this person was already in a relationship. And how you knew it is because they were treating you like that. Shit. If they only coming in here, they not selling down, but acting like it's something better out there they wasn't doing. Or they were waiting like they were coming in to get the good stuff, but they, they were waiting to commit. Ooh, ooh, ooh. ooh, wow, Scorpio. Spirit clarify the high priestess. See, there you go. See, like I said, Spirit said, don't let this person turn you cold and bitter. 
that's their that's their shit to deal with. That ain't got nothing to do with you. They were wrong. They were deceitful. They were toxic. They did a lot of that shit. That's not your fault. They were deceptive here. Somebody was deceptive, Scorpio. This is why you're mirroring their asses. You're cold and detached from them. See there? You ain't got some of y'all ain't got no love for this person here, Scorpio. With the Eight of Cups and the Queen of Swords, you don't want to hear nothing. You don't care because your intuition has already showed you. You already know. Wow, Scorpio. Now, what's up with this full card for Scorpio? It could be an Aries. Why is this here? All about the money, Scorpio. Full card is because this is something that you do not see coming. Or maybe you're saying it is not going to happen. I can't see it. Because like I say, you got this fool card over here with this person and back and forth in their head. They know they did something wrong, but they steady trying to come back because I feel like they're trying to come back and make it right because they know they did wrong. Ooh, the fool card for Scorpio. This person come back because them ancestors messing with them. See there, this person can't get no sleep. Every time this person dream about you and the little time they... It's like this person usually cannot sleep, but anytime they do go to sleep, them ancestors on this person, Scorpio, see? Two of swords here. I feel like this is them and them, them birds on this person here. This person ain't... Anytime this person... Look, got the nine of swords. This is, see that? This person is being tormented here. It's like if they're... If they, if they, at nighttime and they can't sleep, it's because they got you on their mind. If they mess around and go to sleep at night, they got you on their mind, Scorpio. That's how spirit got them because this person's being tormented or this person's being chastised in their sleep. This person has to face it, Scorpio. Spirit is forcing, trying to force somebody to face some injustice to make it right here. Wow, Scorpio. They can't escape it. See, because all they do is see this. This person has you on their mind. See, this person can't escape you. This is all this person do is think about you. This is they tapped into your energy because they they hooked. But I feel like it's guilt. It's guilt, or they're they're being judged here. They're judging themselves here. They are judging themselves harshly, but correctly. I feel like. Give me another card for this full card. See, they go to moon card again. See, see all these nighttime mysterious things. See, this person dreams a lot about you, Scorpio. But I feel like this person here is going to have to face their fear. Their fear is why they keep juggling. I feel like somebody's scared to tell you something, Scorpio. Because I feel like you already know it. But I feel like... I feel like your intuition may have prepared you for this. Some of y'all may not have proof. But intuitively, you may know based on how this person moves. But I feel like this person is going to have to face their fears. And they're going to have to come clean and make it right, Scorpio. Because other than that, this person ain't going to get no rest. This person ain't going to get no rest until they make right their wrongs. And they, they don't, they don't want to do it because they are afraid because it was wrong. Wow. Ace of Cups for Scorpio. Why is this Ace of Cups here? Ace of Cups, see? They're the Queen of Pentacles again, see there? I told you, you already got the Queen of Pentacles down here. You're heavily guarded here. You're heavily guarded from this person, Scorpio. See, you got a new opportunity in love. Something's gonna, some love overflowing is coming to your way here, see? See there, somebody look at you like you are marriage. I told you, four of wands. Ace of Cups, see, this is marriage with the Queen of Pentacles and the four of wands here, and it's gonna be successful. This is somebody who has been watching you. They go to Page of Swords again, Scorpio. <laughs> now, check it out. Spirit just told me too here, Scorpio. For some of y'all, for somebody, this may have not been a romantic relationship. Maybe it was just a relationship or a family, uh, a family that that was that this was toxic. Maybe it was a toxic tie. Because after all, you got the devil card here. I feel like you may have known that this person was in a relationship, but for some of y'all, it wasn't a romantic relationship. It was just their family. Their whole family may have not approved of you. Maybe they didn't approve of you, especially if you the high priestess. Sometimes, do you know people, you know, people be all self, self righteous and religious mind. They may be looking at you like you too spiritual or you too different here. 
You know, I feel like for some of y'all, that's what it is. For some of y'all, it wasn't another romantic relationship. For some of y'all, it was. But for others, it's it's all the above. It was a romantic relationship, plus their family was sedity. They were self-righteous in their own thinking. They judgmental. This is somebody here who would not have approved of who they was with here. And so I feel like you walked off and you told them to F off. Eight of Cups, the Queen of Swords energy. See, somebody coming in here to give you a relationship some type of twin flame, some type of commitment here, Scorpio. You're going to get it anyway. It could be a, a Leo, Sagittarius, or Aries here. They could be watching you too. Look, somebody trying to come in here and give you that ace of wands. Like that fire energy trying to start, show back up again, Scorpio. Now you have your ace of pentacles, your last card here. Spirit wants this ace of pentacles here for Scorpio. Clarify the ace of pentacles. five of pentacles look at that so someone is trying to come in here and make it right because they feel see ain't nothing been happening y'all relationship like i feel like scorpio whoever this person is that you left you ain't look back you probably told them to f off and you ain't look back you probably ain't saying nothing but you got doors opening up for you to keep your attention and your focus in a different direction and not back from not towards the hurt and pain that is a trigger when, every time you elevate, when you don't talk, when you don't look back, all of these things are this person's karma because they have to deal with it. It's as if the Spirit is telling you to release it all. If you release it and forgive it, if you forgive this person and release it and move on, guess what? It's going to go right back to them. That's what it's going to do. You're going to get it all for you. This is, some of y'all, this person, now they feel left out because you're not communicating. You're done with them. You figured them out and they know that they are guilty. And this is somebody here who probably thought that they were of high standards here. This is probably somebody who, who, who had a lot, but they mishandled or abused their authority here. So they feel left out because they're guilty. So they may be trying to come in and bring you some money for something. Somebody, somebody going to give you a big item ticket. Somebody going to buy you something big. And it's crazy. Maybe this look. I don't know if this is the same person coming in, but this is what's coming to you. Some of y'all going to end up being married, Scorpio. The Ace of Cups, the Queen of Pentacles, the Four of Wands, and the Six of Wands. Something's going to happen. It's going to be successful, see? Ooh, Ace of Pentacles for Scorpio. Why is this here? Now, it could be that if you felt that this person left you out of their life here, you got an opportunity coming back. See, this person could have made you feel unworthy here. Especially if they were only coming in for selfish reasons and they, and they wouldn't settle down because they felt like they could do better type of stuff. Ace, eight of swords here. I'm not going to take that. I was talking. Clarify this ace of pentacles. Oof. Seven of pentacles. See? This is someone here who's coming in here to plant this big ass seed because they want progress between the two of you. They want things to grow between the two of you. See, look, there it is again, the Ace of Cups. See, you got the Ace of somebody coming in. Could be, a, could be an Earth sign. Could be an Earth sign. You got the Ace of Pentacles, Five of Pentacles, Seven of Pentacles. See how it's growing already to the Ace of Cups. You got the Ace of Cups and the Queen of Pentacles here. So something is happening. Look. Seven of Cups, King of Pentacles. See, I told you with this four of wands, you got a twin flame. Now, I don't know if it's the same King of Swords or not. I don't know. But like I said, you got somebody. For some of y'all, you got two different people coming in. You got an air sign and an earth sign. And for others, you got the same person here. It's this one person here who is that you're going to be surprised this person's going to do something that they ain't done before like i keep saying this person spirit has been dealing with this person behind the scenes in their dreams especially this person can't get any peace they can't get any rest this person's not doing so good because their wrongs is, is playing out in their body and they're not able to sleep they're not able to rest this person could even be sick because of what they've done I'm telling you, when you do ugly shit to people, it's going to act out. Either it's acting out in your finances, your body, it's going to affect you. And I feel like, you know how you can make a person get karma back real quick, Scorpio, when you forgive them and move on? That's when they get it. That What they say, the, the, the sweetest revenge is success or victory. And, and for some of y'all, this is what it's going to be because 
Either if you got a different person here, this is going to be your justice because somebody's going to put a ring on your finger and they're going to establish you anyway. You are this empress here. And for others here, it's going to be the same person here, here Scorpio. For others, it's going to be the same person. But so, for some of y'all, it's two different people. The one here, because I feel like this other person, the one who did wrong, I feel like it's a Libra. I feel like it's a Libra and a Capricorn, uh, a Libra, got the, got the devil, got the, a Libra or a Taurus here. Because you got the Empress, you got the Justice card twice, you got all these swords. You got a lot of Pentacles too. You got the Ace of Cups twice. So it could very well be the same person. For some of y'all, it's the same paper person. For others, it's two different people coming in here. When one relationship don't do good, Spirit already got you some this way. But for some of y'all, it's the same person. See, justice is coming back in your favor. Somebody's going to come in because they know that they did wrong, Scorpio. I can't help but to stress it. And I feel like it's a Libra for some of y'all. They did you. They did you wrong. They did you an injustice here, especially as the empress here. You see, it's like this person. They, they did it to the wrong person here, Scorpio, because of their issues. Could have been somebody's upbringing, what they were taught. They were afraid to settle down because they felt like they didn't want to lose money. You know, stuck on that money here. The magician, some something, somebody manifesting something here. Now, maybe this is you manifesting something here. What's that? Nine of Cups? Is that the Nine of Cups? I feel like that's the Nine of Cups. Eight of Cups. Yep, Nine of Cups. Eight of Cups here. Somebody's going after their wish fulfilled. They're going, somebody is chasing up behind. Somebody's coming back behind you. You don't walk up, Scorpio, but you don't even know this person's behind you. This person's already behind you. <laughs> You done walked out, Scorpio, but they already behind you. They've always been behind you, but they've been hiding behind the tree. They ain't want you to see they ass because they weird. <laughs> Somebody's a weird person. Oh, Scorpio, this is a it's like you, this is this is the prime example of there it is the stock card. Somebody's holding that hope. This is this is the prime example of opposites attract here. See, there you go, Queen of Cups. I feel like you're self loving yourself, Scorpio. In order for you to get what you desire, in order for you to manifest, Scorpio, you got to self love here. See there, Scorpio? You're going to get what you want here, one way or the other. You hear that? that that's the moral of this reading. Scorpio gets what Scorpio wants, one way or the other. See? Ha, that's the last card I'm going to pull. How be fitting? The Two of Cups. See there? Ha. I knew it was like they had to be. It just seemed like it. Because it seems like it's such a push and pull here. It's, I feel like this king of sword, whoever dealing with a Libra, that's your soulmate. But this person's here to try your ass, Scorpio, because please believe you are trying them. But you're having a bigger effect on them than they are having on you, Scorpio. But please believe, Scorpio, whatever this person did wrong to this connection, that's what they did it to this connection. Spirit is making this person come back and right their wrongs here. They're guilty. Yes, they are. Once again, they are. But they finna make it right if you want them to or if you allow them. Like I said, some of y'all done walked off and y'all tell them to F on and y'all mean it. And y'all gonna go right on in the arms of somebody who gonna really build a life with you and you guys are gonna get married and you guys are gonna be happy. And that's just what it is, Scorpio. All right, Scorpio, this is it, honey. So if this video resonates, please like, share, and subscribe, Scorpio. Thank you guys so much for your support. I love each and every one of you Scorpios. And I will talk to you on the next Scorpio video. Bye Scorpios.